Los Angeles Lakers, Kyle Kuzma. Kyle, thank you very much for making some time and coming on Lakers Talk. Yep, no problem. All right, so Kuz, last night you put up 30 points. Congratulations on the win against the San Antonio Spurs. Uh, I know you've probably surprised a lot of people in your rookie season, but how much of this is a surprise to you, or is this exactly what you expected? Uh, none of it at all. I mean, uh, I work really hard on my game, and uh, you know, I really just try to uh, be as confident as possible. So, you know, for me, it's you know um, what I expected. What would you say about your game this year that you've learned? I mean, yesterday is a great example. You've added the hook shot. There's uh, areas of your game you can hit the mid-range, you can hit the 22-footer. What are areas of your game that you still really want to improve on? And let's just use this offseason as an example. Uh, you know, really just, um, you know, my ball handling. I think that's one thing that can really improve. Um, that can really improve, you know, my scoring ability by – you know, not just being a straight line driver, but you know, a guy that if I get cut off, I can change the direction. You know, um, you know that, and you know, just keep getting better defensively. You know, I think for the, you know, since the All Star break, I've been pretty good defensively. So, just really just trying to build on that. So, has this been? Has it been a pretty overwhelming experience? I mean, to play for the Los Angeles Lakers. What what has that been like for you in your rookie year? Obviously. When you get into next season, you'll have a lot more experience. But what, what has this rookie year been for you? Um, you know, it's been pretty special. It's been fun. Uh, you know, you always grow up as a kid, you know, wanting to be in the NBA. And, you know, now that you're here, you know, you just want to take full advantage of it and really just try to, you know, embrace it all and, you know, never take it for granted. So. The, uh, the the future for the Lakers, Let, let's just kind of stay with the young core for a second. So yourself, Julius Randle, Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball, Josh Hart, what excites you the most of what's to come with this organization, the front office, the coaching staff? What excites you the most? Um, you know, just just the overall growth that we can, uh, we can have. You know, everybody's young. You know, Lonzo and uh, B.I. are 20 years old. You know, Josh and me are rookies and Julius is only 23, you know, so, you know, just the just the aspect of growth, you know, we can get so much better over the years and, you know, hopefully, you know, we're able to, you know, stick around and grow together and, um, you know, really, you know, make some things happen. You know, this year we haven't all totally been on the same page of, you know, playing because of all injury, but, you know, I think that, you know, with time and growth, you know, we could be pretty special all together. Kuz, what, what does that do for you personally? I mean, here you are in your rookie season, and you see there's there's moments where you can see, wow, the, the future is so bright for all of us together. And you start thinking about what next season is and, and uh, all these teams fighting for a playoff spot. Do you think if this core comes back and you guys are all healthy, you think you could be right in that mix with that San Antonio Spurs, the Utah Jazz, the Oklahoma City Thunder? Can you be in the mix with all those other teams? Uh, definitely, I think so. Um, you know, we've had a lot of games that they're, um, you know, the earlier part of the season where, you know, we, we've lost because, you know, I think quite frankly, we just didn't know how to win at that time. Um, you know, you know, we, me and assistant coach were just talking about yesterday that, you know, we lost about 12 games that we could think of that we should have won earlier in the year. If you think about that and we could be in a playoff race right now, you know, uh, realistically. So, um, you know, I think if we're just all maturing and getting better and, you know, we've got a lot of experience this year from playing. So um, I definitely think that. What's it been like with uh, Coach Luke Walton this year for you? It's been great. You know, he's one of my favorite coaches I've, you know, I've ever had. And, you know, he, let, he lets me play my game. He lets me, you know, be myself on the floor and uh, really gives me confidence to, you know, really, you know, do what I do on a consistent basis, you know. Um, you can be as confident as you want yourself, but you know, if your head coach is confident in you, then you know that's going to hold you back. So, you and uh, Lonzo t seem to have a great relationship on and off the court. Uh, obviously, joking around a lot on social media. What's click with the two of you guys? Uh, it's just our friendship off the floor. Um, that's that's usually the most important you know component to you know having good team camaraderie. Really, you know one thing to you know click on the court but when you're off the floor and you can you know mesh and gel that just makes your on the court um you know game speak for itself too 
Kuza, final question. I'll just ask, you know, obviously um, coming from your background and getting to where you are today and really kind of taking the NBA by storm, what, what's your motivation on and off the court? What pushes you every day? Uh, just to be great. You know, I, I love playing the game. Um, you know, I, I would, you know, play for free, really. You know, that's just how, that's how I am. I love the hoop. It's all I do every every single day. You know, if you come to my house, you know, M- NBA TV is on rerun every single day. So, you know, that's, that's all I really do. I just I want to be great at what I do. So, will you watch? Uh, will you watch the playoffs? Is that something you'll watch, or do you kind of stay? Do, do you kind of get away from it when the off season starts? Uh, no, it's kind of it's hard for me to get away from basketball. You yep. know, it's you know, one of my loves. You know, I, I, I always watch it. Um, you know, it doesn't matter. It could be, you know, WNBA. I'm, I'm going to watch. So, Well, Kuz, look, uh, I know there's a lot of Laker fans that, you know, obviously are on this radio station, but they're also, as you know, all over the country. Congratulations on, on such a great start to your rookie season. I know Laker fans are really, really looking forward to seeing uh, this upcoming off season, what, what you can do uh, along with the rest of this core in the future. For sure. Appreciate it. All right, that's Kyle Kuzma, forward for the Los Angeles Lakers. Very nice of him to come on and appreciate the uh, public relations department from the Lakers uh, having him a part of the show.